right, hello. I'm so excited to be here and read this story. We're off to find the witch's house. We're off to find the witch's house. Which house? The witch's house. We're off to find the witch's house, but we're not afraid. No, we're not afraid. We're creeping down the witch's street. Which street? The witch's street. We're creeping down the witch's street, but we're not afraid. No, we're not afraid. We're slinking by a blinking owl, a winking owl, a blinking owl. Wave goodbye to the winking owl, watching with one eye. We're scattling past a skeleton, a skittle scattling skeleton. A skinny, grinning skeleton, shake rattling its bones. We're bolting by Big Frankenstein, the herky-jerky, lurching kind. His heavy head held on with twine. Watch out, don't get too close. We're galloping past a ghastly ghost, a mostly misty, ghastly ghost, a flying, floating, twisty ghost swishing through the dark. We're rambling past a howling wolf, a scowling wolf, a growling wolf, a hairy, scary, glaring wolf prowling in the park. We're scrambling past Count Dracula, a shirking, lurking Dracula, with flowing cape spectacular and fangs that glow so bright. We're running by a mummy now. I hope we'll make it by somehow. I think I want my mommy now. Here. Hold my hand tight. Because we're coming to the witch's house. Which house? The witch's house. We're coming to the witch's house with bats and spider webs. We're knocking on the witch's door. Which door? the witch's door. We're knocking on the witch's door. It opens with a screech. There she is. She's standing there. She's standing where? She's standing there. She is. She's standing there. And we all scream. Happy Halloween. Oh! Hello, witches and goblins. Welcome to my house. I hope you enjoyed that story. Today, we are going to be creating a witch's brew that is bubbling just like mine. You are going to need at least one dry ingredient and one wet ingredient. You also need to write down your recipe. But first, let's take a look at my witch in training, Miss Emma. Witch Emma, take it away. Hello, witches and wizards. I'm Witch Emma. Witch Global asked me to do a STEM project with you, so here I am. Today, we are going to be making a bubbling witch's brew. Pretty hard to make, but I'll guide you through it. Okay, so let's get started. Oh, safety first. Make sure to ask a parent or a guardian 
when doing the science experiment. Remember, this is the goggles. The ingredients we will be using today are werewolf claws. Thank you. Yep. Crushed bones. <laughs> Skeleton dust. Unicorn hair. And vampire toenails. Not a lot. Okay. For our wet ingredients, we have the Loch Ness Lake water. He was not happy when I took that. I'm wondering who the Loch Ness monster. The spider venom from my pet spider. It's kind of crawling on the floor right now. And pimple juice. Can't forget monster snot. And for our last ingredient, juice eyes. Juiced, I mean. Juiced. Definitely juiced. Okay, let's begin. Get two bowls. One for dry ingredients and one for wet ingredients. Now grab your loveness water and pour it into your bowl. Remove these real quick. Go on. Thank you for taking that, Mother. Remember to have a parent or guardian helping you during the assignment. Remember, the monsters are fake. Then grab your werewolf claws and pour them into your dry bowl. Oh, sorry, I nearly almost poured that in the wet ingredients. That's why you have to have a parent or guardian helping you. Okay, you will be adding one, a pitch of crushed bones. Okay, thank you. A dash of skeleton dust. Sanderson sisters. I'm friends with them. A little, only a little bit of unicorn horn. And finally, a dash of vampire toenails. It's kind of hard to scoop up because we don't have a hook a lot. Then we will add our wet ingredients to our wet bowl. To our wet cauldron. Me say a splash of spider venom, two drops of pimple juice, remember, color optional, okay, a smidge, only a small smidge of monster snot. A splash of juiced eyeballs. It's very sticky. Not a lot. That's okay. Okay, now we start mixing the two together. First, we're going to start with the wet ingredients. Oh, it's okay. You know, this is going to be a messy assignment, but. That's the reason why we have a parent and guardian to help us clean up after the assignment. <laughs> this is so much fun. I love this. The whole point of this is to have fun. Oh, and also, don't forget to document your results. Okay, now we are going to grab our cauldron, borrowed from the Sanderson sisters. Thank you, you guys. Okay, then we are going to add, now we are going to add our um, powder to our cauldron. How much are you adding? We are adding at least a tablespoon, one tablespoon, or two if you, or two if you want more, but if you want it 
to like really fizz up only I will. Okay. Now we are going to add only a one, a one like um a four and a half cup of quarter cup, I mean. A quarter cup of our wet ingredients that we added into our wet bowl. Whoa! I didn't see that. It's really Whoa, it's so radioactive. Wow, that was awesome. Thank you for joining me today. I hope you had fun. Welcome back. Thank you, Witch Emma, for that lovely demonstration. Now it is your turn to make your own witch's brew. You need to get out your paper. The only ingredients you may use <laughs> are from this list. Don't forget safety first. Ask a grown-up at home before beginning. Make sure the only ingredients that you use are on this paper. Did I miss anything else? No, but now I feel like I need to redo mine because I didn't say that. I think you did. The only in oh, I hate it now. The only ingredients. <laughs> that you can use are on this paper here. Have fun. <laughs> okay, so this is the after video um, of my little um, project. Remember, there are gonna be mistakes in this. This is just a quick little video to see what happens when you mix the rest of your ingredients from your science experiment. See what happens. It's rising! It's <laughs> rising! It's rising! It's rising. It's rising. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I am the potion bender. <laughs> uh, ah! It popped. It popped. It popped. <laughs> it popped. So, one, 